and welcome to Medical Dialogues. I'm Roshni Dhal. Let's look at today's top health highlights. Waste to height ratio strongly predicts risk of type 2 diabetes impaired fasting glucose according to a study. Waste to height ratio independently predicts the risk of developing impaired fasting glucose and type 2 diabetes, says a recent study published in Obesity Research and Clinical Practice. Ning Chen from Capital Medical University in Beijing, China and his colleagues wrote in their study that the association was partly mediated by systolic blood pressure, lipids, HOMAIR and other kidney and liver metabolism indicators. Diabetes mellitus is a frequent chronic disease that significantly impacts the cardiovascular system. The leading cause of death among diabetes patients is cardiovascular disease. Diabetes is linked with several major cardiovascular complications including heart failure, coronary artery disease, agina pectoris and myocardial infection and peripheral artery disease and stroke. Anthropometric measures that is waist to hip ratio, BMI and waist to height ratio have been used as predictive factors for incident hypertension. Against the above background, the research team conducted the study to evaluate the relationship between waist to height ratio and the incidence of impaired fasting glucose or type 2 diabetes. The team also explored how lipids, blood pressure and other kidney and liver metabolism indicators mediate these associations. The research was based on a functional community cohort that comprised 6,109 participants. They were divided into two sub-cohorts. The relationship of WHTR were evaluated with type 2 diabetes, impaired fasting glucose using Cox regression models to determine the discriminatory power of WHTR and other anthropometric indices on type 2 diabetes. The authors calculated the area under curve and four-year time-dependent receiver operating characteristic curve. The study findings show that both sub-cohort found significant positive associations between WHTR and the incidence of type 2 diabetes. The waist to height ratio was a valuable predictor of type 2 diabetes. Mediation analysis revealed that SBP 5.10%, HOMAIR 0.45%, creatinine 9.36% and triglycerides 11.02% and combined kidney indicators 17.48% partly mediated the WHTR's effect on type 2 diabetes in men. For women, this association was partly mediated by HDL, SBP, ALT, UA and combined kidney indicators. The study showed strong correlations between waist to height ratio and type 2 diabetes impaired fasting glucose. WHTR is an independent risk factor for type 2 diabetes and impaired fasting glucose development, the researchers concluded. SBP, lipids, HOMAIR and other kidney and liver metabolism indicators partly mediated this association. That's all for today. Stay safe. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.